Hello to my channel Chinese Star Today we will bring you the following hot and exciting news. Zyozan's Jade Bones may be aired first in South Korea, which reminds me of the suicidal gamble of His Royal Highness Wolf. Speaking of the rumors about which drama is scheduled, it is really reminiscent of the Wolf is Coming I often heard when I was a child story. Every month is like crying wolf, which always makes people look forward to and disappointed. Such rumors really make people's ears go numb. If there is one drama that makes your eyes light up, it is Jade Bone starring Zio Zan. You will definitely not be able to stop watching this drama. Zio Zan's acting skills and appearance are both top-notch, and the plot is also gripping. In short, don't hesitate, go and see it. Speaking of which drama schedule rumors come on time every month, as punctual as a woman's aunt, it's really dumbfounding. This show is really a constant topic of discussion, and new rumors will appear every once in a while, making people unable to help but wonder. The rumors of this drama scheduled release are like an old friend that comes every month. People love and hate it, but no matter what, it is impossible to ignore. Needless to say, it must be Ziozan's Jade Bones. This drama will definitely make people look forward to it. After all, with Ziozan, a powerful actor, the plot will definitely be exciting. So, don't hesitate, go catch up on this show. This drama is really confusing. Fans love and hate it. They look forward to its update every day, but it just doesn't come. It's really eye-catching. Looking forward to the stars and the moon, it missed the 2022 summer schedule. After finally waiting until the end of the year, it missed the opportunity for the finale. It's really dumbfounding. On January 4, 2023, a surprising news came. The copyright of a certain drama series was bought by a Korean TV station, and it can be seen in South Korea in the future. This news is like a duong, sudden, but also exciting. And, interestingly, the way the Korean media reported the news was quite unique. They shared a still of Ziozan and Jade Bones on social media and wrote excitedly, Ziozan, he is finally here. This sentence expressed their expectations and expectations for Ziozan in the play. Excitement. Nanny? Does it mean he's coming? What does this mean? Domestic audiences have been looking forward to the drama he's coming, but the waiting time has been so long that the flowers have withered, and they still haven't waited for its release. Unexpectedly, Korean audiences saw this drama before us. That's right. This news basically tells us that Jade Bones has a great chance of debuting in South Korea first. Of course, sister you didn't just draw random conclusions based on the words Korean media. I have three reasons for saying this. I heard that South Korea had already purchased the copyright of Yuguyaro before. Full stop. I heard there are new developments in Jade Bones. Before, everyone only knew that they had obtained the copyright, but the news that he's coming this time made it clear that this show is really coming. It seems that the drama we have been waiting for for a long time is finally coming to you, which is really exciting. Jade Bones is really awesome. Other domestic dramas are first broadcast domestically, and then the rights are slowly bought overseas. But as for Jade Bones, it hasn't even been broadcast in China yet, but it has been officially announced overseas that the copyright has been obtained. This speed and this treatment are really enviable. This kind of operation is really confusing. In addition, there is no clear explanation on the internet about how the producer in South Korea arranged the arrangement. Is it simultaneous broadcast or first broadcast in the mainland and then overseas? These specific broadcast methods have not yet been determined. I heard that the broadcast time of Jade Bones that many people are looking forward to has been changed to 2024 on Dubbin. It seems that we have to wait patiently to watch this drama. If the platform did not have the exact information, why would it suddenly change the time to 2024 instead of using the original 2023, or simply leave it to be determined? There must be some inside story that we don't know. In general, judging from various circumstances, Jade Bones is likely to be broadcast first in South Korea or at least be broadcast simultaneously with the country. This makes people start to speculate that this drama has a great chance of being broadcast in South Korea. Regardless, we are looking forward to its wonderful performance. Jade Bones is a TV series adapted from Kang Yu's novel Zhu Yan. It mainly tells the story between Kong Sang Crown Prince Shiyin and Chi Clan Princess Zhu Yan. Shiyin is a cold person, but Zhu Yan is warm and generous. After the two met by chance, they experienced many things together and slowly grew up. Together they guarded the Kwangsang dynasty and became an indispensable force. Frankly speaking, this drama started filming on March 29, 2021, and ended on August 4, 2021. 
Everyone has been waiting for it for more than a year. Now it's finally finished, and I look forward to seeing you all soon. This TV series is always rumored to be aired, but it never comes out, which makes people anxious. Now I heard that it might be broadcast overseas first. This fate is really full of twists and turns. In the domestic entertainment industry, if there is any actor whose drama is not going well, it is Ziozon. His plays encountered broadcast problems one after another, which was really frustrating. A recent military drama Ace Force experienced a series of troubles before it was aired, including competition for spots, deletion of scenes, negative reviews, star reduction, and ban on streaming, etc. This show really got off to a bad start. Please advise for the rest of my life is a love drama with many twists and turns. It has gone through a lot of unlucky things such as being scheduled, withdrawn, postponed, and suspended. However, fortunately, there are two top-notch actors, Ziozon and Yang Zi. The cooperation is highly anticipated. Speaking of the costume dramas in which Ziozon has participated, one must mention the sensational His Royal Highness Wolf. At that time, Ziozon played the second male lead in the drama, and the way the drama was broadcast made the film crew spend a lot of money and adopt a suicidal gambling strategy. In short, this drama earned a lot of attention at the time, and also allowed us to see Ziozon's outstanding acting skills. So, the question is, why are Ziozon's dramas always full of twists and turns? Let me give you an example and use the drama Your Majesty the Wolf to briefly explain the reasons. The costume drama Your Highness Wolf is really full of twists and turns. It started filming as early as 2017, costing a total investment of 300 million, and took five months to film. But I didn't expect that it was put on hold for more than three years after the filming was completed. It was really hard to wait for the film to wither. Fortunately, I finally met everyone, and it lived up to expectations. On November 19, 2020, this highly anticipated TV series finally met with everyone, but its broadcast method is really unique and will definitely open your eyes. This drama was launched quietly, with no publicity at all and not even a trailer. Five episodes were immediately released as soon as it started airing, and later, all 49 episodes were generously released at once. This operation is really unexpected, such a surprise. This is simply a crazy gamble of playing with fire and burning yourself. Although the film crew gave understandable reasons at the time, it even made people feel a little sympathetic. Hey, it's actually not easy for the producers. They worked hard with so many people and finally produced this work, but in the end they had to worry about resistance and smearing from Ziozon's negative fans. It's really a headache. This is why we kept revising and procrastinating until we saw a glimmer of hope and couldn't wait to release the full episode. They had no choice but to give it a go and have a daring showdown. The key to this contest is who is more powerful, Ziozon's negative fans or his true fans. Who will have the last laugh? Hey, if the bet is successful, the work will attract a large number of viewers, the actors will become famous, and the platform and the producer will also gain a good reputation. This is really a huge profit. If the bet fails, the work will be disliked by everyone, complaints will continue, and questions will be raised. Even the actors will suffer. Actually, there are indeed some anti-fans who have not even watched Your Majesty the Wolf, but they just give it one star on Dubbin and leave crazy messages to smear it. Just because they don't like Ziozon, that's it. It's really speechless. They completely missed the hard work of the many actors and behind-the-scenes teams behind the show, as well as the dazzling moments and highlights. They seem to only see the surface without truly appreciating and realizing the value and charm contained in this drama. Furthermore, do you really think this is appropriate for Ziozon, the second male lead, to bear all the pressure, responsibility and war? I remember that when the drama was finalized in 2017, Ziozon took a group photo with other actors. His clean, warm, bright and clear healing smile is truly unforgettable at first glance. The current situation is really sad. Some people's gossip, random speculation and groundless accusations have caused this young, promising, energetic and hopeful young man to bear too much pressure and pain that he should not bear. He was originally a sunny boy who loved life, was passionate about work, and full of hope for the future, but he was troubled by other people's irresponsible remarks. This is so unfair. In general, the film crew's explanation for the gamble broadcast method adopted by His Royal Highness Wolf actually explains why the broadcast of Ziozon's dramas is always so unsuccessful. In this way, we will understand the reason. Probably the production team of every drama will have similar doubts and uneasiness. In fact, 
Xiaozan cannot be entirely blamed for this matter. After all, he cannot have the final say on this matter alone. At the end of the day, the blame lies with those mindless fans and those fans who love to cause trouble. They are the real problem. In today's society, excellent actors and works are expected by the public. Similarly, we also need rational fans of the drama and fans with correct values. They can inject more positive energy into the entertainment industry and make film and television culture healthier and more positive. So let's be fans and fans of the show together. Actors, fans and drama fans work together to make progress together and jointly create a fresh, harmonious and rational entertainment industry network environment, so that those disharmonious voices will gradually disappear. A good actor can devote himself wholeheartedly to the performance without being restrained. The film producer can wait for the review to pass, and then smoothly arrange the broadcast time. I sincerely hope that Jade Bones will not repeat the mistakes of Please Advise for the rest of my life in Ace Force, and that the road to broadcasting will be smooth and will not encounter so many twists and turns. Thank you for watching. Please remember to like and subscribe to our support channel.